The Very Snowy Christmas by Diana Hendry, illustrated by Jane Chapman. It was Christmas Eve. Big Mouse was making cheese pies. Little Mouse was making paper chains. Merry Christmas to us, sang Little Mouse. Big Mouse, can I decorate the Christmas tree now? Can I? Can I? Sure, said Big Mouse. Let's do it together. Little Mouse hung mistletoe berries on the tree. Big Mouse put a star on the top. We forgot the holly, cried Little Mouse. I'll go and get some, and off he went. Little Mouse set out, singing Jolly Holly, Holly Jolly, Jolly Holly Christmas. He ran over the bridge, and soon he found a holly bush with shiny red berries. Oh, Jolly Holly, Holly Jolly, Jolly Holly Christmas, sang Little Mouse, stretching high to reach some. All at once, soft white flakes started falling around him. The sky is coming apart, cried Little Mouse. He made a ball of white flakes and put it in his bucket to show Big Mouse. Then he hurried back over the bridge. Suddenly he saw a strange creature in the water making faces at him and waving its arms. Oh, squeaked Little Mouse, it's a mouse nest monster. Little Mouse could see its paw prints coming after him. He ran and ran, and still the mouse in this monster followed him. At last, Little Mouse saw his house, but there in the yard was a huge white mouse. Big Mouse, help, he cried. The sky is coming apart. A mouse nest monster is following me, and now that scary white mouse is staring at me. Oh, little mouse, said Big Mouse, the sky isn't coming apart, it's snowing. There aren't any monsters, look, those are your paw prints, and your reflection in the water. And this is a snow mouse I made, Big Mouse said. Would you like to make another one with me? And so they did. When it started to get dark, Big Mouse and Little Mouse went inside. They hung up their stockings for Santa Claus and warmed their paws by the fire. I love Christmas, sang Little Mouse. Jolly, holly, holly, jolly, jolly, holly Christmas. The End